last year at Fort Pier High. My name is Alan Green. I can teach the same grade that I'm technically in. We have a real family here. I'm a Max. Yeah, most of us don't like Greg very much. Hey, friends. Shut up. Me? Well, my name's Carl. I like hunting. I just got fired. Hello, class. My name is Mr. Bradley. Our new teacher? Down to the worst. God, I hate you. Okay, Matt, take the croissant. Why? Just take it. I don't want to. Just take the croissant. I don't want to be part take of your... the croissant. Alright. There. Okay, so I'm gonna ask for it back, and you say, or what, like in the movies, okay? Alright. Give me the croissant. Or what? You will have to face the croissant sequences. Did you do that whole thing just so you could say that? Well, I mean, it was pretty funny, right? Yeah, that was hilarious, Alan. Craig, come on! I'm enjoying this moment, I don't need your criticism. But now that I'm back teaching, doesn't mean I don't hate you anymore. I... I still hate you. Didn't... Craig, I'm gonna throw you off a cliff. So I am back to teaching after being fired. I know, hooray, applause, but uh, it wasn't easy. Why do you care if I have an uncle? You know what? I'm not leaving until I get this job. Ah! Oh! Oh my god! It was worth it though. I was able to save the class from possibly the most boring human being on the face of the planet. You must be thinking, man, I want to kill that guy. Well, I wanted to kill him too. Well, I mean, you kind of already did, Alan. Okay, I didn't kill him. I just gave him severe brain trauma and he'll never be able to walk, talk, or breathe on his own again. But I didn't kill him. Honestly, I'm surprised you didn't go to prison. Craig, why are you here? It's 7.15 in the morning. School doesn't start for another 45 minutes. Why are you here? Well, why are you here? Craig, get out. Yeah. Just okay. go. Who are you? Okay, go. Yeah. Craig. I think I won that one. Anyway, it's the last year of high school for these guys, so um, I gotta make it special. So, uh, school's been pretty good so far. Um, we've been here for a few weeks, and I'm actually kind of enjoying it. A lot of stuff happened. Tommy left. He went to go to a different school for a better football league, I think. It's your place, Tommy. That guy. Quite delicious. My full name is Draxelik. However, I'm casually referred to my sober kit, Drax. I'm spending my 2016 school year in this educational institution in Fourth Pier, South Dakota. I was conceived in New Greenland in the year 1999. Due to the herd of immigrants invading our home, my kinsfolk determined to settle in South Dakota. Yes. I've had many years of schooling, all of which unfortunately have resolved in either the teacher being slaughtered or a mass plague killing the majority of the students. I am quite ominous for the upcoming educational sessions throughout the calendar year of 2016 through the year of 2017. Thank you. It's a real word. Ever since Drax got here, there has been a lot more tension in the classroom. It's actually gotten pretty bad. 
Boston's the worst city. Yeah, well, does that fancy watch of yours even tell time? Striped socks are the sexiest socks in Iceland. No, they're not. You don't even live in Iceland, and you never have. It's obviously I live dots. in the Icelandic Everyone... fjords. No, you don't. Yes. We no, are in Iceland. Why are you guys disagreeing all the time? Why do you hate each other so much? Well, it's all well, Craig's fault. fault. What did I do? You guys were yelling before I even got here. Guys, honestly, I don't care, okay? Just, just sit back in your seats. No. Okay, on that note, uh, tomorrow you guys will be starting a new group project. Okay, you're gonna make a school newspaper. Pretty much all you have to do is just interview some people around school and then just kind of put it in a newspaper. Um, it sounds serious, but it's really not. I am tracking your teamwork on this one. So make sure to literally work your butts off. Craig, be quiet. I didn't even say anything. Craig. What? Shut up! You were the one asking- Craig, can I get through one thing without you being stupid? I just... I don't get it. I don't understand why everyone hates me so much. I mean, I understand if, you know, they want to make fun of me once, but every day? It's because you're an idiot. Uh, I'll be splitting you up into pairs, so uh, your grade will be combined uh, with your partner. Will we be entitled to the selection of our own comrade? I don't know what that means. To avoid any issues, I will be picking your partners. Can you please put me with Matt? Well, I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but even Craig? Hey, it's not my choice. We're gonna be leaving it up to chance. Don't pull the names out of a hat. No, Carl, I am not going to be pulling the names out of a hat. I'm going to be pulling the names out of a cup. God! All right, here we go. Craig is going to be with... Hey, what do you know? Matt. Yes. Yeah. No. Whatever, it's just that he's so creepy. And, like, he's weird, too. Oh, this? This is just emu jerky. There might be a feather in it. I have not yet formed an opinion in regards to if Carl will be an acceptable companion. I am emboldened, though, that this camaraderie may extend for a long period of time. It takes me a few seconds to figure out what he's saying, but I think he's going to be a good addition to the class. We're probably not going to have any colored pencils, but I don't think anyone needs those. I use colored pencils for my coloring book. I'm disappointed that he would do this to me. Come on, Drax. Why you gotta be so weird? My hobbies? My hobbies include knitting, watching VHS tapes, and listening to music that does not even exist yet. Once the music exists, I immediately become disgruntled. Also, I don't purchase any of my food. Everything I digest comes from my own personal farm in my backyard. I get the sense you're wondering about the meat I consume. Well, I eat my own animals. What is your question? No. No, it is not legal. So Matt and I put up some flyers around school to see if we could find people to interview. And currently on the list, let's see, we have the home monitor, Mr. Monty, and a few other teachers. So, uh, yeah, today should be pretty interesting. So if you go like that and like yeah. that. Hold it! Ah. Please! <laughs> hey, Matt. Hey, Craig. Jesus, Monty, you scared the crap out of me. I know. <laughs> you can't just go jumping out of corners like that, man, all right? Sorry, it's a habit. So, y'all are doing the newspaper? Uh, yeah. We just need to know, uh, you know, what's going on in the hallways. Anything, really. Well, you wouldn't believe what happens in these halls. If this keeps up, I'm gonna have to ask for an assistant. Really? Yeah, man. If people found out what happened up underneath this roof, they'd be sending in the SWAT team, the Army, the CDC. Well, then we... Probably don't want to hear it. Yeah, okay, so there was this one time where this kid was in the hallway and he was standing at his locker, right? And he said, oh, I don't feel so good, Mr. Mani. And I said, you need me to take you to the nurse? And he was like, yeah. And then he suddenly, just, just a bunch of cockroaches and worms started spraying out of his nose. Like it was some supernatural stuff, okay, man. Okay, that is disgusting. Wow. And I swear, right after that happened, this girl's liver imploded and her belly was like the size of like a kangaroo. Oh, God, no. I honestly don't think we can put this in our newspaper. Hey man, it's the truth. This school's out of control. Do you want the truth or? Oh boy, this school is great. We're nothing but flowers and butterflies and sunshine that'll cradle your heart and happiness. 
We don't want something that's gonna trigger your gag reflex. Hey, I'm just saying. Thank you, Mr. Monty. You've been very helpful. Kind of. Yeah, no problem. So who's next? Um I'm my two favorite students do it. We're over, we're over here. How are ah, my two God. favorite students do? No. Dr. Fontana. Let's just say he's loud. Dr. Fantano is our um is our computer teacher. He's blind and partially deaf, so he doesn't understand much. This will fix the virus! I'm trying to update my software. Yeah, don't, don't, don't do that. That's not a good idea. Uh, we're good. How are you? I've never been better. In fact, this may be the best day of my life. That's great. Thanks. Thanks. Um, so you want to be included in the newspaper extra? Yes! Yes, please! Okay. Well, all right, Dr. Fantana. First question is how do you- Okay, Craig, I'm ready for the questions. Okay, I'm gonna start the questions right now. My breath smells quite foul? No, I want to ask you questions about your class. What? You, you dropped your clipboard. No, no, no we're no, alright. Uh, we, we Let me help you with that. Ah, oh my God. I got your clipboard. Ah. Can you please leave? We're done with you. Anytime, Craig. I'm glad I can help. Oh my god. Hey, Craig. No, 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 never, not gonna happen. What's the opposite of yes? Oh yeah, that's right, no, 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 no. Hey, wait up, hey, stop. Mr. Bradley, we don't need an interview from you. Why not? We're just, we're done, we're done with the interviews. Yes, we were surprised to see you, and we're glad that you're alive. Yeah, my therapist says I am pretty lucky. He says I'm a beautiful shining star. Yeah, that's great. It's good for you, but that's not the point. We don't need to hear your story. Don't you at least want to hear what I have to say? Fine. Mr. Green has exhibited horrible and irresponsible behavior. Oh my god, Matt, come on, let's go. This guy's a joke. Oh, he's got it. Like, he, he's in the If I were the principal, I would fire him right now! Look, Alan is a good teacher. He's immature and he hates me, but he's not a bad teacher. We learned more in the first day with him than we learned in the two months that you taught us. Okay, what did Alan teach you that's so special, huh? Well, uh, we learned that Tommy's gay. Oh yeah, that's important. Yeah. Mr. Bradley, you're never going to be as good as Alan. Stop trying to get him fired, man. It's never going to happen. Uh, I hate Alan. I mean, I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill that slacker. <laughs> It is difficult to put words and knowledge into a project such as this. Drax, do you have any family out there? Or other weirdos like you? Um... Uh, Aunts or uncles? Indeed. I have an uncle, but why? See, now we're getting somewhere. So, I'm assuming he's alive. No, he fell through a small trap door and broke his neck. Uh... So, he was like building a house? No, they were hanging him. Alright, Drax, so Mrs. Gordon's gonna talk to us about what her life is as an algebra teacher. Is that okay? I scheduled it for two. How grand of you, Carl! 
Yeah, so, um, in the meantime, I was wondering if you want to go shoot some hoops. You know what that means, right? Ah, yes, of course. I do grasp a deep passion for the fine sport of basketball. Look at that. Oh man, something's seriously wrong with that guy. Oh, why is he, why is he still wearing his pants? Wait, what do you mean? Like he's got, he's got the, he's got two pair, he's got one pair on his head, and then he's wearing another pair. Oh, yeah. Where did he get the other pair? I don't know. You should talk to him though. I'm concerned. Yeah. Hey. Alan? <laughs> Wait, what's up? What's up, guys? Oh, nothing much. We we're just wondering what you were doing. What do, What do you mean? No, we just saw you outside with the, with the pants in your head running around. Oh, you, you mean the the running around and stuff? Yeah, yeah. What's going on? Are you okay? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. I'm I'm fine. I'm I'm just trying to make a viral video. You know, I'm trying to become YouTube famous. I'm doing a bunch of crazy stuff and posting it on the internet. That's that's how you get famous these days. So you're like trying to become YouTube famous? Craig, that's what I just said. There's no reason for you to respond with the same statement I just made, but rephrase that as a question. Craig, you're like the human equivalent to the cone-shaped paper cup. I mean, you can't put them down anywhere, so you're just forced to hold them all day. It would be much more practical if it was just like a regular cup. There's really no reason for you to exist. Uh, I have five videos so far. Uh, this is my latest one. It's called Man Runs Around With Pants On His Head. Um, it's, it's gonna be a hit. Uh-huh. So, uh, yeah, I, I know only, only two views at this point, but uh, it takes time. Just, just wait and see. Hey, another view. See, what did I tell you? I'll be walking down the red carpet in a few days. Alan, you realize that second view was yourself, right? I'm gonna refresh the page for days. Well, as you all know, your projects are due today. Yeah. <sighs> okay, let's get started. Craig, Matt, get up here. Show us how it's done. Wow. That was both informative and entertaining. Good job, guys. All right. I do not know how you're going to beat that, but uh, Carl and Drax, come on up. Well, hello, fellow students. For this project... Okay, so the school archery competition was this week, and we've actually got the winner, Bobby Woodberg. Hello, everyone. We inquired if Bobby would demonstrate his archery skills, and, well, he accepted. So you shall begin. Who are these people? I don't know why I agreed to do this. Okay, I need a volunteer. Oh! Oh! Can I do it? Okay, so I just put this on my head? Yes, I'm gonna shoot it right off your head. I'm assuming you got the right arrow. Yeah, yes, I did. Well, can I have it? Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> sorry. Okay, here we go. Good thing we use the metal ones, huh? <laughs> what? Oh! oh my god! You bought the wrong arrows! Do you, do you want me to call an ambulance? Uh, um... It's okay, I got it. Woo. Oh! It's not as bad as it looks. Really? You don't think it's... Yeah, it's as bad as it looks. Alright, that's it. I'm, I'm calling number one. No, it's okay, I got it. I feel like... I feel like my breath sounds really weird right now. Is it? <laughs> Come on. This isn't my fault, right? This classroom, just these people, I'll never understand. What was that? He, he should have been more specific in the regards to the arrow. <laughs> I, I mean... 
what? So, yes, I did have to go to the hospital, but um, it wasn't, it, it didn't hurt anything vital. Um, I think it only punctured, like, two of my lungs, so it's, it's really not all too bad. And the arrow thing was really cool, so Carlin Drax got an A+. Plus. I can't believe they got a better score than us. I mean, they shot Allen with an arrow. Why didn't we think of that? Well, I guess that concludes this chapter of the year. We're done? Thank God that's over. See you later, guys. Is it done? Well, there was one complication. What kind of complication? Well, one of the students grabbed the wrong arrows. It was going to work, but the arrow messed up the shot. I told you to do one thing, Bobby. You were supposed to get rid of that green. I guess I just have to do it myself. See it burn in my soul. I to Alan. You're in there. I know it. Jack? Jack! Yeah. Hi! Ah, uh, what's up? <laughs> Have you uh, seen anything about Bobby or heard anything? Oh, I didn't know you had that power too. What? No, no. I don't have any powers. I'm talking about Mr. Bradley. Have you heard anything or seen anything about him? Oh, oh, yes, of course. Well, Mr. Bradley had lunch with Bobby after we interviewed him. I remember them mentioning something about Alan. Or maybe a dragon. Look, Drax, or... I think Mr. Bradley's gonna hurt Alan. What? What could possibly be the motive to acquire such an activity? I don't know why. I think he's just jealous. I think I'm gonna tell Alan. That is not necessary. Allow me to deal with this situation. Drax, what are you talking about? Let's just inquire that I have ways to make people permanently disappear. No, 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 Drax, no, no. Whatever you're thinking, just don't, don't do it. Why not? It's not messy, and... No, no, stop. That's weird. You're... I'm afraid of you now. Stop. Okay, 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 fine. Yes, you should inform him. Thank you, Jesus. But if this method of yours is abortive, just know that I have the nail guns prepared. Wait, what? You heard me. Yes, Carl, I can assure you, sharks are real. Class is over, guys. Hey, Al, I gotta talk to you for a second. Yeah, what's, what's up? No, you're wrong. I strongly believe that your party is the false one. Guys, what's going on? Carl here presupposes that the title of a certain musical number by an artist by the name of Drake is online bling. Whilst I am certain that the name of the number is most unequivocally highlight bling. It's online bling. I have heard it. I've heard it too. It was stupendous. I mean, it was highly admirable. I'll show you highly admirable. Yo, 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 yo. Guys, stop fighting, okay? We're all friends here. Yo. We did not. Ah. Huh. Anyway, y'all can y'all can leave. Hey Matt, what, what's up? I just wanted to tell you that uh, I think Mr. Bradley's gonna try and kill you. Well, that was blunt. I'm being serious. I just I overheard Bobby and Mr. Bradley talking, and he's definitely planning something. What's he gonna do? Hit me with those th things that he has? I don't know. That seems very unlikely. I just I don't. Can can we have some privacy, please? Please. Just thank you. So I, I talked to Alan, and he told me not to worry, but it's, it's just really hard not to. I, I care about him a lot, and it would, it would just be awful to see something like that happen.
All right, as you guys know, it is the last day of school. Yeah. Yes. All right. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. yeah, I know it's That's exciting. Awesome. Wow, yeah. Um, what are you guys doing for summer, by the way? Um, I'm actually going to the Icelandic Fjords to go rat hunting with my Aunt Bertha. It's going to be awesome. And I'm going to bring my best friend Drax along, too. I was going to go strangle and mutilate sheep in the mountains, but I was invited to go with Carl. And I think we're going to have a splendiferous time. Well, I'm glad for you weirdos. Um, what about you, Craig? Well, uh, I'm actually preparing for law school. Well, you're stupid. What about you, Matt? Um, I'm actually going to West Africa. Uh, I'm going down to help the starving kids there. Wow. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. Man, that was so much better than Craig's summer. What? Law camp is exciting, right guys? Craig, nothing you do is exciting. I think we can all agree on that. Not everything. It's just most... So, uh, Alan, what are you going to be occupied with this summer? Any plans? As the Americans say. I'm actually going to the Bahamas. Hey! Whoa, what are you doing here? You put me through so much pain, so much agony. Now, you're going to be able to feel exactly what you put me through! Mr. Bradley, get out of here. Shut up, Craig! Hey, man, I feel no pain. What? Pain don't hurt. There's nothing you can do, Mr. Bradley. I'm, I'm sorry. Ah, uh, you'll see. You'll see just how much. How <laughs> throw that? What? No, no, I didn't do it. Wasn't me. <laughs> nice, Carl. That guy's so messed up. Well, yeah, I'm going to the Bahamas. Anyway, um, I just wanted to say to you guys, thank you so much for an amazing year. Y'all are the best class I've ever taught. Well, I mean, you're the only class I've ever taught, but you're the best out of the, out of the one class, but you're the one class, but you're the best. So, um, all right, you guys are free. Yeah. Yes. So you think you can't feel pain, huh, Alan? Somebody, somebody call 911. Somebody call 911. Oh my god, Alan, are you okay? Well, seeing as I just got shot, I'm probably not doing so well, Craig. <coughs> Sorry, I'm an idiot. No, no. Come on, Alan. Stay with me, man. <sighs> I just had this crazy dream that I just got shot. Oh my god. You did just get shot, Alan. What? Oh, oh my god. Oh, where did Matt go? I don't know. I, I think he ran after Mr. Bradley. Whatever. Alan, you're okay. You're okay. You're gonna make it. Hey, Carl. Came to join the party. Woo! We gotta find something to stop the bleeding. How about this landline? No, I'm done, man. There's no going back. No, Alan, you're gonna live, man. You have to. You know, all the time that I've known you... Alan... Shut up! Let me be sentimental. I've been making fun of you. Not because I hate you. It's not because you're not smart. It's because... <coughs> no. Shut up! It was because I was envious of you. You're smart and you're kind and I was jealous of that. I'm sorry. Carl, you're like a son to me. We're the same age. I don't care. You're still like a son to me. I just don't understand how that would work. Carl, you're my son, okay? Okay. You have the potential to be something amazing, okay? And I'm just, I'm, I'm glad to have called you my friend. 
I'm, I'm glad to have been able to call you all my, my, friend, my friends. It was a pleasure being your acquaintance. No. 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 Should I do mouth to mouth? Don't even think about it. Craig, what's wrong with you? So, you guys think this will go viral? Yeah. I, I yeah. really no think so. Yeah. Accumulate a lot of views. So, luckily the horrific attack by Mr. Bradley was caught on camera. So I was like, hey, this is an instant viral sensation. I'm gonna be famous. Uh, by the way, I only had to spend uh, a few hours in the hospital. Apparently it was only a BB gun. Um, it hurt really bad though. I mean, those things, whoo, mama. They hurt. I'm really surprised that Alan's still alive. I mean, first he gets shot with a bow and arrow, and then he gets shot with a gun. He's really lucky. I'm glad that Mr. Bradley was arrested and taken away. I didn't want to have to use this. Yeah, that would have been bad. Save it for later. So the accident definitely delayed graduation. But now that Alan's back, it's time to go. And, um, yeah, it's actually time to go, so. Hey, guys. You look splendiferous. Thank you, Jax, you do too. All right, I'm gonna go get a drink. Tommy, I missed you so much. Yeah, I missed you too. No, I'm serious. Like, you don't understand how much I've missed you. Uh, okay, all right. Like, it feels like something's missing when you're not around, and it's just like... <laughs> oh, wait. I'll, I'll get a drink too. This is the best cake I've ever tasted. Um, that's not cake. My life is a mistake? Jonah. Huh? I don't know, this is... It's the last time I'm gonna see you guys. It's, I don't know. This isn't the last time you're gonna see us. We, we love you, we're gonna visit you, we're gonna see you. Oh yeah. I forgot about that. D def visit me. Yeah, we'll totally visit you, Alan. You know, actually, don't don't worry about it. You you guys don't have to visit me. It's fine. All right, you guys ready? Yeah. yeah. Frankly, I don't believe in photography. Whatever. What does that even mean? Oh man, I love you guys. Shut, Shut up, Greg. Oh.